Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Full Body Stretch. It's Wednesday, August 5th, 2020. My name is Lisa Breezy. I'm an exercise physiologist, wellness heart coach, and founder of State of the Heart Fitness, and I'm happy that you're here, whether you're live on Zoom or you're watching later on YouTube. Woohoo! Today's 45 minutes of a good full body stretch, starting standing up and then coming down to our hands and knees, seated and eventually lying down. Um, lots of good stuff to open up those joints, stretch that connective tissue, the tendons, the ligaments, the fascia on the muscle fibers, cut through the cobwebs to open it up, increase our agility, improve our posture, and all of that good stuff. So without further ado, remember always listen to your body. If there's something that doesn't quite feel right, make sure that you honor that and you adjust if you need to or take a breather, okay? All right, we are gonna start off by warming it up. Let me grab my phone here just in case we need to adjust the volume. All right, feet wide. Feet wide, let's start swinging those arms and singing. It's all right. Yes. Warming up the body, getting that blood flowing. Such a happy song, right? We don't have the sun coming out just yet. It's up, of course, but it's a little that coast foggy-ish morning. But it'll come. It's all right. So just get those joints, get those knees involved, get that body moving, smiles on those faces, sing it along if you'd like to. You know, I don't really like to sing that much. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a joke, right? I say it's all right. So we just want to get our heart pumping, the blood flowing to those muscles. We want to increase our core temperature. Increasing that temperature in the muscles makes it more elastic. Gets the kinks out. And let's just reach those arms up. Good. Just kind of flow it here. Whatever feels good. Just move into that body. Connect. Breathe. Woo. Oh yeah. Keep those arms up. Maybe about shoulder height. Just turn that torso. Get that whole body involved. Wake it up. Woo. Yes. Arms down, swing. And let's take those hands to those inner thighs. And let's just go side to side. Bring those feet wide. I say it's all right. Oh, yes. Get a little stretch in those inner thighs. And let's drop those shoulders down. Good. Getting a little bit of a stretch through that rib cage. Oh. Woo! Anybody feel a little warmer? Smiles are a little bigger. Good. Excellent. And let's just hold it here. Feet wide. We're going to inhale, arch the back. So tilt the tailbone up. And then exhale, tilt the tailbone, round out your back. Keep those knees soft. Inhale, arch. And exhale, round it up. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round it out. Inhale, arch. Keep that spine moving. Exhale, round it out. Touch that tailbone. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round it out. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round it out. Good. Keep it in going. Just feel the flow. Close your eyes if you can to really tune in and feel. Inhale, arch. Exhale, tuck it in. Breathe deep and slow. 
lake, or if it needs to be in a pool, whatever feels most comfortable for you. For me, it's a lake on, in Minnesota with the loons in the background, looking up at the blue sky with the big puffy clouds. To me, that's heaven. On a lake in Minnesota and on the back of a horse. That's heaven to me. Woo! Big circles to find your little place of heaven in your mind as we do the back stroke. Nice fluid movement. Good. Remember, movement equals life, right? Every little movement you make, sending a signal to your body. We are alive, we are well, we are here, we are here right now. How lucky are we? Good, let's reverse. Let's do that forward motion, the crawl stroke. Again, those knees are involved. Let that body flow. Good, and reverse. Stevie's one of 
one of those mystical, whimsical human beings on the planet, isn't she? And shake it out. All right, team. We're going to bless our body. We're going to stand with our feet hip width apart. We're going to reach those arms up. Inhale back. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale up. Exhale, fold. Inhale up. Exhale, fold. Oh, you cannot tell a gypsy that she's no longer a member. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Keep it going. Let that flow happen. And as you do, bless and honor that amazing, beautiful body you have. That body that carries you through every single moment and step of your life. From the time we're born to the time we cross over to the other side. So let's love and honor all of our tissues and organs and cells. I imagine just light, golden healing light coming in and surrounding every tissue, every cell with its light. Love it. Couple more. Last one. And let's fold forward. And let's hang out here for a moment. Oh. Keep those hands just hanging. And then let's do some outward circles. Keep your knees slightly bent, your feet hip width apart. Let gravity stretch your neck. Rotate those arms. Right, rotate those shoulders. Let the momentum take those arms. And then reverse. Inward circles. Inward circles. Roll your chin shoulder to shoulder. Again, let gravity stretch that neck. Feel the strength in the back of those legs. Keep those knees slightly bent and just hold the arms here. Roll the chin shoulder to shoulder. And then slowly start with your tailbone. Stack one vertebra slowly on top of the other. Take your time. Take your time. With your shoulders, your neck, and your head the last to come up. Wow. Go ahead and roll those shoulders once again in a backward direction. How we doing, team? Smiles on those faces. Woo! Shake up those arms. Hands on those hips. We're going to start by rotating our upper body, our head, drawing a circle on the ceiling. Keep your hips steady. Yes. So not moving the hips, just getting movement in that upper body. Keeping those knees soft. How we feeling out there, team? Like a million bucks? Woohoo! All righty, a couple more. And then... We reverse to the other side, other direction. Oh, it's time to let our child's heart out, right? With the child's heart, go face the worries of the day. With the child's heart. Good, and then let's stand tall. 
let's roll those hips in a circle. Good. Keep those knees fluid. Keep that upper body fairly steady. Shoulders, head don't move on this one. Hula hoop hips. Yes. Just feel alive. Good, and reverse. For those of you who were with me on Monday, we really got to experience the child's heart with Allie and Cleo and the stuffies. Polar bear and little horse. So much fun. Heart come out more often, right? Good. All right, and rest. We're gonna swing those hips. So if you need to use something for balance, that's fine. We're just gonna swing forward and back. Opening up those hips. Standing legs slightly balanced. Vegas nerve when we sing out, right? <laughs> Our Las Vegas nerve, according to Rita. The vagus nerve, the big nerve in our body that actually stimulates the relaxation response, the rest and repair, the healing phase, the healing part of our nervous system. Yes. The Feel good to open up those hips, swing those legs. Let's turn around, let's do the other side. Big step back with your right foot. All righty. We're just gonna take those arms out and palms down. And we're just gonna lean into those fingertips. Left side. Good. And then we're gonna take that elbow down onto our knee and we're gonna bring that right arm over Stretch into those fingertips. Feel that stretch all the way down. Good. And then bend into that front knee a little bit more. Breathe long, slow, deep breaths. This song is called Be Not Afraid. And it will forever remind me of my grandpa Jerry. Good. Come on up. Switch, turn the other direction, bend that right knee, left leg is straight, arms up, palms down, lean into that right side. And the reason why it reminds me of my grandpa Jerry is because, well, my grandpa was such a, an amazing, gentle human being. Loved nature, he was an incredible fisherman. Minnesota, let's lean that right elbow down. Reach those arm, that top arm over, reach through the fingertips. And uh, sadly, when I was a kid, he was sick. He had a few strokes and he had Parkinson's, so he was very quiet. But he loved to come out to our place on the lake and walk in the woods and with his suspenders on and his fishing hat. And he would always ask me about my horses. 
But unfortunately, I was always kind of afraid to get close to him because uh, I knew, I was always afraid he was going to die. <laughs> and he did when I was 14. And that was the big, such a, that was the first big loss of my life. And I remember thinking, I don't know if I'll ever be able to smile again. Obviously, that was, I was young. Let's go ahead and come and roll those shoulders. But this song was played at his funeral. And I always remembered it. And I love the, the name, Be Not Afraid. I go before you always. So it brings me comfort. Anyway, I, did, I hadn't thought of this song in years. And I saw it on Spotify. I'm like, oh, I'm going to play that. All right. Okay, everybody, we're going to take it down to the floor. All ready? So take that stronger leg forward. Brace yourself. Come on back down. So Grandpa Jerry, we're thinking about you. He's like, oh, I know. I'm right here with you. <laughs> Spread those fingers. And we're going to arch the back. Cat and cow. Tilt the tailbone up. And exhale. Tilt the tailbone down. Round out your back. Inhale. Arch. Exhale. Round it up. around hip circles yes get those hips moving how are we feeling team in other unrelated notes that you probably don't care about I had a <laughs> I had a little juice this morning that had garlic in it a little anti-cancer juice well, I am tasting that garlic. Woohoo! <laughs> good thing I, well, let's see. I'll, good thing we're social distancing. I have a client later. And I'm wearing my mask, so that's a good thing. Okay, rotate the other direction. Big circles. Sing along song. You must have been cold there in my shadow. You're like, oh, Lisa, how about let Bet sing that, huh? I'll try and refrain. Can't make any guarantees. All right, everybody, let's go ahead. And we're going to take that right ankle, or right leg, sorry, not your ankle, but your ankle too. You're going to bring that up underneath you. We're going to stretch those hips and the glutes. So you take that back leg, point those toes back. Bring those arms down, forearms down. Get that glute stretch. And then I want you to just adjust your hips and find that place where you need it the most. Whether it's the glutes, whether it's the hip on the other side. Everybody. Did you ever know? Find the 
spot that works for you. Sway those hips a little bit. Did I ever tell you that you're all my heroes out there? You are. Yes. the dog. Drop one heel down and then the other. Breathe. Just really appreciate where you are. Feel your body. Tune into it. Where might it be speaking to you? Calling for a little more TLC. Drop those heels down. Press the chest back. Contract your quadriceps, your thighs, and hang out there. Breathe. Good. Now let's take that left or right foot. Let's do a right foot. Bring it up right between your hands if you can. You're gonna push back into that heel back there, okay? And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that left hand, actually left hand on the floor, and then we're gonna bring that right arm up and twist toward the ceiling, reach up through the fingertips, drop into those hips, drop into that lunge, straighten that back leg, push through the heel, a little bit of balance going on here too, if you probably noticed. Reach through those fingertips. Breathe deep. Mm -hmm. Couple more deep breaths here. Inhale through that nose. Exhale through the nose or the mouth. And then let's come back down, hand down. Bring that foot back. Walk yourself back into down dog for a moment. Press the tailbone toward the ceiling, chest toward the thighs. Hmm, long, slow, deep breaths. And then let's take that left leg, bring it up, right between the hands, plant on that right arm, and then with that left arm, reach up toward the ceiling. Good. Rotate back, reach through those fingertips, push through the back heel, get that stretch, drop into those hips, breathe slow, deep breaths. Working on that balance, working on that core strength as well as a stretch, take a couple more deep breaths here. And then come on down, back to down dog for a moment. Woo! And then let's come to the knees. 
And let's sit back into child's pose. Reach those arms forward. Bow the forehead to the floor. You guys are amazing. Sit back, bring those knees wide if you need to. Good, and then walk your hands to the right side until you feel that stretch in the rib cage on the left side. Walk it over to the left side. Feel that stretch through the right side of the rib cage. Breathe long, slow, deep breaths. Now a smile a face, a girl that shares my name. And then walk back to the center. Come back up and let's take a seat. Even though we ain't got money, I'm so in love with you, honey. And everything, hands on those knees. Let's just go ahead and roll the head around, doing some neck circles. Back is tall, heart is forward. Heart is forward and wide open to life, to receiving receiving love to giving love to the world. Rotate that head. Good. Slow and controlled. Good. And reverse. Other direction. Everybody sing. Even though we ain't got money, I'm so in love with you, honey, and everything will bring a chain of love. And in the morning when I rise, you bring a tear and joy to my eyes. Good, and bring your head back up. Woo! Left hand, tilt, right hand, palm down. Time to start your day. Thank you, Alexa. Oh, God. We've already started it, honey. Good. Feel that stretch. Deep breath in. Exhale back to center. Right ear toward the right shoulder. Right hand assist. Left hand. Hold down. We ain't got money. I'm so in love with you, honey, and everything will bring a change of love. And in the morning when I rise, you bring a tear of joy to my eyes and tell me everything is going to be all right. Hands on the knees. Inhale that heart forward. Exhale, round it out. Inhale, forward. Exhale, round it out. Again, smooth, fluid movements. Think of that spine being fluid, flowing in the wind. Feel the tides of the ocean or the waves flow forward, flow back. I love that song, just in case you didn't notice. Mm-hmm. Oh, and I love this one, too. Really, Lisa? You put it on your playlist? I don't think you'd put a song on that you wouldn't like. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. Good. Fine. Moving forward and back. <laughs> In case you didn't notice, I sometimes entertain myself. <laughs> Uh, and then let's do the coffee grinder circles. And you know the saying, those who can laugh at themselves never, never cease to be amused. 
Ain't that the truth? <laughs> I'm blessed. I grew up with a, a lot of humor in my life. A lot of humor. <laughs> my mom is obviously one of the top humorists in the world. <laughs> and my dad. And my aunts and uncles. And my cousins. You know, sometimes it's if you're not going to laugh, you'll cry, so you might as well laugh. But generally, lots of laughter. And it's the best medicine, right? Good. Back is tall. All right, team. Let's go ahead and let's take those legs out. Good. Inhale those arms up. And exhale, fold forward. Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. I'm going to bring my camera down a little bit. Sorry, team. Keep it going. Hi. Let's do this here. There we go. Oh, gosh. Lisa, don't fall over, for gosh sakes. Maybe I should have just let it be. Oh, there's a song. Let it be, right? Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. Let's do a couple more. Inhale up. Exhale, fold forward. Reach up. Hold it here for a moment. Take those hands. Bring them out. Push the palms up toward the ceiling. Sit tall. Flex your feet. Bring those toes back. Breathe in and out through that nose. Feel that stretch through the spine. Feel some activation in those muscles as you bring those toes back. You feel the quadriceps contract, but you also feel the stretch in the calves and the hamstrings. Bring those arms down. Push them out to the side, palms down, or I should say palms out, fingertips down. Heart forward, shoulders relaxed. Keep those toes engaged. Excellent. And then let's take those arms and let's reach them towards our toes. Just find that spot. You don't have to touch your toes. You can place your hands on the front of the shins. Just breathe deep. Try not to force the stretch, but go to that edge. If on a scale of one to 10, we're talking range of motion here. One is not stretching at all. 10 is you're ripping your muscles, which you never want to do. We're at about a seven, that place, that edge where you feel that stretch, anything beyond that would be starting to get painful. We never want to be in pain. We want to feel the stretch, but not be in pain. Breathe deep and slow. Good, and then slowly roll your spine up. Now let's take our feet, the soles of our feet together for a moment. Take your hands over your toes. Drop your knees down. Good. Eyes closed for a moment. Shoulders relaxed. Heart is forward. Spine is tall. Breathe some long, slow, deep breaths. Stretch in the inner thighs. Smiles on those faces. Yes. And let's go ahead and take those hands. Walk our hands forward. Keep those knees wide. Feel that inner thigh stretch. Why is it important to stretch? Why is it important to be flexible? Because when we're tight, when that connective tissue is tight, when those muscles are tight, they start to pull on our structure, pull on our spine, they affect our posture, which makes us weaker, makes
makes us more susceptible to injury, makes us more susceptible to falling. And as we get older, unfortunately, that becomes an issue. It can become an issue if we don't stay active. Good. And roll yourself up. Woo. Let's lie down on our backs. How we doing, team? Who loves stretch? I do. Good. Roll yourself down, hug the knees into the chest, and let's just rock side to side. Give yourself a little back massage. You even get a little applause. How, does it, how about that? That was Yanni, his song called Until the Last Moment. take that, keep that right knee in and extend that left leg out onto the floor, okay? And then with your left hand, bring that leg across to the left side. Your right arm comes onto the floor. Turn your head over that right shoulder. Keep your shoulder blades flat. Feel the stretch all the way down your spine into that right hip, into that glute. Take some long, slow, deep breaths. Let that breath flow effortlessly in through your nose, all the way down to your toes, to your fingertips. Bringing energy to every part of your body and as you exhale, you let go of what is no longer needed. Whether it's tension in your body or it's stress and worry in your mind, let it go. Feel that body opening up. Deep breath in. Exhale, bring that leg up and switch. That leg comes down, left leg comes in, hug that knee in. And then let's take that right hand and bring that leg across your body. Left arm extends, turn your head over that left shoulder. Keep your shoulder blades flat. Bring those knees back in for a moment. And then extend both legs out to the floor. Take those arms over your head. Big stretch. Long, slow, deep breaths. Stretching that whole body. Really reach through the fingertips. Reach through the toes. Kind of move. Move your body. Feel. How can you get more from that stretch? breath in. Exhale. Bring your arms down. Let's roll over onto our left side for a moment. Stretch our quads. So rest your head on your hands. Bottom leg is bent. Take that top ankle with either your sock, your shoe, your pant leg, or a towel or a stretching strap. You're going to flex that foot. Push your heel away. At the same time, tuck those hips forward. Feel that stretch down the front of your thigh. Relax and breathe. Mm. Holding each stretch a minimum of 15 seconds, up to 30 or longer if you have the time when you're stretching on your own. Good, and release. Let's go ahead and bring ourselves over to the other side. Oh gosh, we gotta finish up here. Well, we're pretty close. All right, let's go ahead and take that top leg. Flex that foot, your bottom leg is bent. Oh, she thought I said her name, look at that. Good, push those hips forward, push that heel away. Breathe long, slow, deep breaths. 
Feel that stretch down the front of your thigh. Oh, yes. Good. Deep breath in. Exhale and release. Let's come to a seated position. And let's just go ahead and sit for a moment. Palms up on our hands. Heart is forward, back is tall. Eyes closed. Feel your breath in and out through the nose. Down deep into the lungs, deep into the heart, deep into the belly. Take a moment to pause. Pause in the peacefulness of this moment. Find that inner stillness in your heart. And remember that this is our truest state of being that lives deep within matter what's happening in our crazy world around us. Let's go ahead and take our hands to the heart. Rub those hands together. Press the thumbs in. Bow the head down. Let's make this world a better place today. Let's take this energy out there. When we heal our heart, we heal the world, team. Namaste. Thank you so much for joining me today for Full Body Stretch. That concludes our session. Ah, who feels better than we did about 45 minutes ago? Yeah? All right, everybody. Thank you so much for coming today. Those of you who joined me live or on uh, YouTube, thank you. And if any of you want to stay on for a few moments, I have a few moments before I have my client today at 9, but I'd love to chat with you. Thank you. Tomorrow is Strength and Balance, 30 minutes, if you can join me for that. And then Friday is uh, Progressive Relaxation, 30 minutes. So tell your friends, share. Thanks for your donations. Again, if you can't donate, keep coming back. But just give to the world in whatever way you can today. All right. Love you all. Have a good day. Bye.